Hello, chess fans. This is Thug Doug. Going to play some five minute blitz. See what we're going to get today. Do me a favor and hit that subscribe button for me. Playing Dominic, Dominic Lawson, right? 2190. Ooh, got ourselves a Carol Khan. Do I want to try something different here? I'm taking is quite often uh, what's played. I think I'd stick with this. That's strange. Why would you do that? Don't understand that move. Okay, that makes more sense. I mean, if I go here and he takes about queen e2, takes on c2, I play um, e3 is a trap, goes here. There he goes there, got trapped. So I guess maybe that means I gotta go here and protect my pawn. That's unusual placement for queen, but it doesn't look bad. So that was the idea behind queen a, a5 is to hit my queen with the bishop. I've not seen that before. At this point, I just want to play bishop g2 and castle. Or d4 actually, d4 is, oh, I can't, okay, can't do that. So this is b2, castle, and then so what's he looking at here? He's looking at knight b6, followed by knight d5. Hmm. All right, I think I can, can be okay with that. Knight b6, I'll go to queen to b3. And once I get d4 in, I feel like I'm in, I'm back in control here. Okay. Feeling better about this now. Next comes C4, which should be fairly decent. Threatening C5. Also can have uh, Bishop D2 followed by Bishop C3. It's a nice placement of my pieces. All right, he backs off. Okay. Well, that makes me wonder here. Hmm. I'll play bishop d2. So where's his queen going? I guess he's got to go to a6. This kind of looks like it's getting good for me. His queen will be a little bit out of play. Uh, a6, I'll play rook c1. Oh, he's going to go there. Okay. Hmm. Wouldn't mind having my uh, a file opened up. Let's put it this way. Let's see what happens.
Oh, it's going to voluntarily give me the A file. That's interesting. I feel like my position's gotten better with this. Okay. Can, uh, is that the best square? Or maybe this is better. It's the best square. Hmm. There. So keep him from playing C5. What now? I think I should get my king in the center. I'm going to slide the king over. Get a better square for the king. Well, okay. I don't understand that. Why is that not just because it'll take this and then you have both uh, rooks under, under fire? That's nice. Okay. All right. And if I go there, then he's got a bishop here. Okay. So that's a problem too. But if I ignore it, can't ignore it. Can't be ignored. And here, he plays bishop there. Hmm. Don't know. This is not good. All right, maybe I've got to give up my B pawn. It's better to give up the B pawn if I have to. Yeah, but the C pawn's following. Ugh. Okay. Let's go this route. Let's just take. Oh, wow. I just saw it. <laughs> it's mate one. That was, yeah, that was not good. That was a wonderful game. Curious. Uh, let's go to the analysis board real quick here. I don't know. I go back a few moves. I played. I know how the situation is here. It's even. King e2 is bad. King e2 is bad. Better is 90, 95. Yeah. Keeps keeps the bishop out of d3 and and um I'd be happy if he took the knight with the bishop. King two. C4. That's yeah, pretty even still. I had to, okay. So that was not the best. Interesting. Bishop G5. Pinning the, uh, so what happened? So if Bishop G5, why not just, um, just take, 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 uh, here. There. Oh, what's going on there? Why can't I? The heck? Oh, I see. If you take it, then these oh, these computers are so good at the tactics. Okay. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.